All right, Tyler's back from business in Vancouver. Tyler, talking about Lululemon is very productive. Yeah, it doesn't seem to matter whether it's controversies over those dangerous drawstrings on hoodies or those see-through pants, but uh, Canadians love to buy from Lululemon. And now a new report from a CBRE group They've determined that they're one of the most productive companies here in Canada. Now, the CBR group, they've uh, determined this based on sales per square foot. The Canadian average this so far this year is $673. And let's take a look at the numbers. You can really see how much uh, Lululemon just eclipses almost everybody. Now, Apple, they're in a league of their own. They're at an average of $7,241 per, per square foot. Lululemon, uh, they're at 2,961. So a bit of a jump there, but uh, just take a look at Costco. They're number three in all of Canada. They have half as many sales per square foot uh, as Lululemon. So uh, if we take a look at the next set of numbers, there are some things to highlight, like another local company, like uh, you know uh, Mountain Equipment Co-op. Uh, they're averaging above the Canadian average, which is uh, $770 right there. And despite store closures with uh, Best Buy slash Future Shop, uh, we, we know that Future Shop closed all or uh, at least combined with uh, Best Buy earlier this year. They're still doing well above the Canadian average of $800. But let's take a look at Target Canada. That's at $98. And, and what they did is, uh, despite all the store closures, they annualized the sales. They did the math to determine what they would have had by the end of this year. And you can see those numbers are not pretty when it comes to Target, just $98 mm -hmm. uh, per square foot. So despite what you're seeing uh, with the Canadian economy, whether we're calling it you know, contraction, recession, uh, what have you, Canadians still like going to the retailers and shopping a lot and because uh, the number that I said at the very beginning uh, with the Canadian average, uh, mm -hmm. just over $600, that's actually up 5.9% compared with uh, the previous year. So Canadians are still out there spending quite a bit. I missed the dangerous drawstrings on the hoodies. Oh, you know what? You were on vacation, uh, 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 Sophia. I, I remember doing the story and uh, they actually had a recall over uh, drawstrings that would be dangerous if you pulled on them, they'd fly back and hit you in the face. So they had a recall over that that is sounds really really, really <laughs> dangerous yeah. all right okay i'm sorry i missed that story it was a good what one happens when you, it happens when you take vacation yeah. tyler thank you very much you bet